Alright, and we are back with some tower climb. I actually got to see how this intro changes now that we're in chapter 2. Because I know that the chapter 2 screen is different. So, what happens if I just let this animation play? I guess we'll find out. Can you hear me okay over the game? It's tower time, that's right. Time for lots of ridiculous deaths. And can't wait. Maybe we'll make some progress in chapter two. Maybe. See, there's the ground. Okay, it just zips up. Like that. And actually, if you watch this long enough, you can kind of see what happens at the end of chapter one. The dude takes the balloon. Floats up thinking, you know, that was it. My journey is over. I'm done. Oh, but wait, there's just more tower. It's towers all the way up. Okay, let's do some tower climb. If I go to my log, you can see this is where I actually made it from tower one to tower two. Conk, that was the big guy, Conk. It's funny, I was watching Tobash stream this earlier and he also got extremely far with Conk. So I think it's something about Conk, he's the chosen one. Uh, and we haven't made much progress since. If I go to my cards, I played a little bit last night before bed. My deaths on crush traps went from 33% up to 42. I'm not making progress in reducing that number. I guess we'll find out if we can do it tonight. Well, I had, I had done chapter one in the beta quasi. So really, I'm not getting much better. Chapter two! Let's hope we get Conk tonight, because he's going to carry the team. Boring. Lately, I've been trying to build with almost completely jump jars, because you get so many corrode pots in the first area that it's worth it having 11 extra jumps. Um, I saw that Xeno. Not too interested, but maybe. Because I'm very low on money right now. Uh, I think chapter two, or I think uh, Tower Climb only has two chapters. Only two. What a short, terrible game. I'm not even going to get that chest. Fuck it. Ugh. Ooh, I had to crack my thumb, like, that whole time. There we go. You get extra jumps with the light platforms, but you can't take that those from level to level. Okay. Should be able to run past these. Uh, where do I want to go? just do a jump thing here or I could uh, that would have been nice to grab that that's okay okay Ugh. I don't know what happened I just got super sniffly out of nowhere I don't know why what happens if I give her two corrodes again have we done this I think we've done this before, I'm gonna try it. Come on, give me something good. Can you change my name to Conk? Two Hadu Orbs. Oh, it turns into a shop. You gotta buy them. I thought she just gave them to you because you gave her the things. Exactly, go left. Oh, I didn't see that one. Fuck! Another crush trap! <laughs> Son of a bitch. You heard ragweeds been going around lately. What is ragweed? 
What is ragweed? Alright, let's not die this time. That strategy isn't... Alright, let's not die this time. That strategy has not been working. Don't even ask what happened there, because I don't know. No clue. It's a common allergy, huh? No, it's like, I don't know. I don't know, man. It could be. I, I've had shitty eyes the last few days, like an allergy thing. 44%. God damn it, Quasi's gonna keep track. Here comes the next one. Nope. Not today, my friend. Beautiful. I've never had that sensation, Carlo. I've heard about that. Like, if you get an allergy to something that your your throat closes up, never experienced it. Okay, this could get me if I'm not careful. Never happened. I can't even imagine what it would be like to have your throat close up. That must be scary as shit. I'm just gonna stick to this wall. This wall's been good to me. Good wall. Um, this one is not so easy to dodge the explodies, so I don't think I'm gonna do it. We're good. Easy. Uh, and then there's those up there. And I really thought I could grab that. And I couldn't. I totally underestimated or overestimated. Oh, come on. Just fall. <laughs> Just fall. Oh, shit. Okay. At least it wasn't the crush trap that time. Come on, Walter. Alright, Arthur's got this. He's the chosen one. <sighs> Can't catch a break. I was thinking if there's an easy way to get that chest, but I don't think there is. Ah, oh, fucking hell. Uh, let's do that. Spring. Worked out! No, it didn't. Arthur was not a bright guy. Set on. He's not gonna get sat on by the crushed blocks. Half. That was a good half functional pun I just came up with. Here, if you want, I can give you the exact number for uh, for your quasi, so you can give me an exact percentage and make me feel even more terrible. What's that? Okay, never mind. I don't even know what it was. We 
berry doesn't... Oh no, it does look a little bad to get just because of the fall block. Hey, at least I kind of went the right direction. Nice! Did it! New record of the night. You get sick like every week? When I uh, was a preschool teacher, I, got, I was pretty much perpetually sick for several months until eventually my immune system became strong. But until then, life was pretty terrible. Fuck me in the butt. That was terrible. I did not expect that. I thought I was playing all cool as a cucumber. Apparently I wasn't. Hey, Regret Roulette. How's it going? I like your name. Actually, I've seen you before, but not to make you feel like you're new. I just never told you that I liked your name before. Teaching preschool while perpetually sick sounds like hell. You pretty much have to get perpetually sick in order to teach preschool. Like, it's impossible to do the latter without also doing the former. It'll just never happen. That crush blossom get me because I'm gonna be greedy. Nope, not today. If I say it, it doesn't happen. It's only when I think it and don't say it that it happens. I do like your name, Mana Cat. I like most of these names in chat, except for maybe Zombie Nixon. Not a fan of zombies. Kinda sick of them. But the Nixon makes up for it. Oh, you see it wiggled. It didn't even beep. It was like, I don't even think about it, buddy. Once you spend three to five years in Texas, you'll get allergies to everything here bad. But when you build up a resistance, you mean? I'm so confused. Oh, this sucks. Okay. We're cool. We're cool! We did it! We beat the game! That was really terrifying, but we're okay. And, oh, that was dangerous. I was looking to make this thing fall so I could get the berry, but then I realized I wouldn't be able to get that berry. And then the spikes nearly effed me in the A. Hey, buddy. Nice. Yeah, buddy. Yeah. Name came up before the whole zombie thing. There's a little story behind it. A dumb one, but there's a story. So it's not pointless. It means something. Oh, no. I told you you'd get sat on. <laughs> Let's see. Yeah, instant death. It's tough because the crush blocks, you can't be revived from them. That wasn't totally bullshit. I should have looked before I jumped. It was absolutely my fault. It just, it just stung. Ugh. If we don't make any progress on chapter two, we can also go back to chapter one and do some quests. Because there's some cool quests that I've never done. Yeah, Quasi's here today. I saw da uh, Davio in my chat like years ago when I was playing this, but I don't think I've seen him in a while. See, I gotta learn to love the crush blocks. 
I work with the crush blocks. Make them my buddies on my side. Let's see. Oh uh, yeah, Davio did the music in this, and he did a really phenomenal job. That's my sound of, of, I don't even know, I can't think, right now. <laughs> it's so hard to give like clever commentary and plays at the same time because like my cognitive functions are just so like split right now, it's crazy. There's a chest on the left, if I was Tobash I would go get that chest, but I'm not Tobash. Damn it! Oh, I tried. I tried, tried so hard, and got so far. But in the end, it didn't even matter. Ah, oh, fuck. Oh, Davy, I was with you. Yeah, I guess I guess that makes sense. I think I went over this yesterday. I was like, oh yeah, you guys are brothers. He would be. Was it worth it? No. <laughs> I got a spear out of it, which in this level isn't useful, but in the next one it might be. It may be useful soon. Fuck. I don't know why I thought that was a safe spot. I was convinced that it was a safe spot, and it wasn't a safe spot. Alright, to the Volt Caves this time. That's my goal. I, I, what's this guy's name again? This guy's getting to the Volt Caves. Just saying. Oh, fuck. Yeah, never mind. I take that back. Well, we're still alive. Don't give up. Never give up, never surrender. Ramirez? Alright. Ramirez is doing it! He's going to Volt Caves. He just used his revive potion to make it more interesting for you. You should thank Ramirez for his sacrifice. Oh, fuck. Spikes and lava. Okay. I'm going on the left wall. Why am I even going right? Why? This this wall is just going straight up. Like, hey, buddy, you want you want to go to the top? And I'm like, no, nah, I'm cool. Berry. Berry buddy. Ooh, look at all those berries over there. I'm gonna get those berries. I'm gonna get the berries. There you go, got them berries. Told ya. Told ya. You thought I was gonna get crushed. But I, I'm so disappointed in how you didn't believe in me there. You were convinced. I bet, I bet both Quasi and Davio looked at each other and said, He's gonna get crushed! And then I didn't. Yet. Yet. No, I got lasered. See? I told you I wasn't getting crushed. It was Beatrice. Not Ramirez. Yeah, I was gonna say, I didn't think that they always had female names. I was, I was pretty sure... Galfredus. Um, I was pretty sure it was all male in the earlier builds, so... Really, really cool that you guys added that in. Alright, time to not get segmentated. Okay, 
hear that, the teeniest little gasp I've ever let out. It was like... <gasps> Ah, god damn it, all these paths that I can't just go up without using resource. I know I should not be afraid to use resource, but for whatever reason. Alright, I'm gonna go use a resource. My goodness. Yeah, I remember seeing the names file in older builds, and I tried editing it once to just be the Vine Sauce streamers, and it didn't have any effect on the game, so I was like, oh. Okay, it singed my booty. You see it? Yeah, I think it'd be awesome, quasi. Um... Oh, damn it. If only it had not gotten set off. <laughs> so close. So close. Yeah, what I was just gonna do, I was just gonna like bring up the viewer list and copy and paste it into whatever file you put in. But yeah, Nightbot does have that too. It, it, it'd be a huge extra step, probably not even worth the the work. But I know Nightbot, like a Monica, Monacap said will keep track of who's been active in the last 15 minutes so that you can just do polls and raffles based on who's been chatting um which has been convenient like that's what i've used for naming characters and rpgs sometimes all right we're riding it down oh no i regret everything riding this one down right regret nothing there though I almost deeply regretted that one. Okay. I gotta really stop doing that. It's not gonna be worth it in the long run. Okay, look for lasers, KY. Lasers. Hey, Magogs. What's up? You think I just won? I'm just gonna chill here. I could have probably rushed up past it, but I gotta really break out of those rushy tendencies. Okay, so I think I have three jumps? Correct me if I'm wrong. Oh my god, so if you're sticking to a wall, you can't be spiked? Like if you're if you're against the wall and you're sliding down, I don't think you can be spiked because I just survived the shit out of that. Go. Oh, I don't like that laser up there, but there's a berry in it for me and safe spots ahead after that. So. Wait, there's a crush block up there. Uh, wait. Haha! <laughs> but then if I push this, it's probably still gonna fall on me. Um. Yeah, I'm just gonna corrode it. See ya.
We were kids when we started making this, and Unity Unreal wasn't free, so there was no real free option besides what you use. It's really outdated now. But it works really well, so that's all that really matters. Getting a lot of uh, berries. A lot of blaries, which is nice. Just look out for lasers, KY. Worth it. That was worth it. I got a new revive pot. It was tricky, but it paid off. Yeah! Proceed with caution. Nice. I love the, the kind of bloomy effect. That was the dumbest thing I've ever done in my life. Oh, believe me, I know, Carlo. I know. Carrie, why am I so stupid? Because you're a dumb idiot. Not a dumb idiot. You asked. I wasn't prepared for the truth. Oh, down. Okay. Right here. Right here. I could easily just climb that left wall and feel totally safe. But I think a little bit of edge is healthy. Keeps you on your toes. Volt caves time. See, I just had to get warmed up. Volt caves! Let me get a corrode. I actually have spikes. Even better, because I can reuse them. Because the crazy beebles are here. Not worth it! Okay, yes it was. It just probably was not worth the risk, it's especially considering the whole right wall is just totally open. So I think I'm gonna go back down and do what I should have done in the first place. Alright, touch fuzzy, get dizzy things, need to go. See, this took me like almost all the way up if not all the way up I'm not gonna get that berry I'm not Tobash I need to stop trying to be Tobash gotta be myself okay Beeble you're gonna get fucked Beeble oh god there's two of them no they teamed up on me I was unprepared for that god damn it I was ready for one Beeble but not two Beeble I should have immediately switched to my next item and thrown it straight up. But I just couldn't react in time. I gotta practice. I need more practice. The wall on the left, maybe, yeah. It's kind of panicking a little bit in case it wasn't clear. Alright. Stick to the walls. Walls are your friend. See? See how much, how high it's bringing me? Ooh, that was the craziest maneuver I've ever done in my life. It totally paid off. Oh, no! <laughs> I was so happy with that move. Just for the record, I was so happy with it. 
I don't even have the Karud. Fuck. What am I- Ah, uh, fuck that. Fuck that level. <laughs> uh. Ulrich. You know what we need? We need Conk. Conk would know what to do. Marcus. Uh, I'm not feeling Marcus here. Oh no, there's a laser. Not anymore. <laughs> yeah, maybe I should start with a couple corrodes just in case. These platforms have been very generous lately with the um, whatchamacallits. With just the jumps. in that chest, but I will get this berry. Oh, no. Damn it! Same trick again. Fuck me. The same exact way. Edge it. Cool, I didn't know that. Where should I go, left or right? Um, I think just the platform above me is great. Okay, cool. Did it. Got an item jump, I know. I, I, I have... I'm actually really good at... Or pretty good at item jumping. I just haven't been doing it. Because I'm trying to just use my potions more. Because that's what everyone said last night. Yeah, you can you can play the first tower again. In fact, there are incentives to do so because there are lots of secrets in this game. In fact, I might if I keep failing chapter two, I'm probably gonna go back to chapter one and just try out some tricks and quests and stuff. Yeah, like, even though this has been absolutely destroying me, I feel the segmentation plan's extremely fair. Um, like, you can- everything is telegraphed, like, really strongly telegraphed. There really aren't a lot of surprises here. It's just so much to manage that it takes practice. Which there is an easy way to stick if I didn't hold jump before- in, if I didn't hold jump out of the jump into the wall. If that makes sense. Because I can do it when I'm when I don't have a second jump proc, but if I already do have one, like right now, and I'm not already holding jump, then there's no way I can just stick. I have to do the dance. Okay. Got a berry. Are these really... Oh, no, they're almost back-to-back. -back. Okay. I thought they were, like, really far off from each other timing-wise. But I think things start their cycle when they first come into camera view. So that that never actually happens. Like, you won't get two perfectly staggered lasers because they always start within time of each other. I could be totally wrong about that, but that's what I think it is. Yeah, guys, if you own this on Steam, uh, review it. 
because that helps them a lot or really just share it with your friends and try to spread their word. I really, really want success for this game because it's just absurdly good. Push it all the way up there for me, yeah. Okay, no, 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 no. No! Fuck! I couldn't keep track of all the lasers. I couldn't do it. I couldn't do it! Uh, okay. I'm just gonna take a moment to meditate and pray for Conk. I am her pet at some point, yes. We got Lucas, which is pretty good too. Um, so start doing nine jumps, two corrodes, no teleport, and revive. Should probably get a teleport, but. I gotta, I gotta go back to basics, you know? I used to be, be really willing to take, like, the long way around if it meant avoiding danger. Even if it, like, was a much longer way or a much slower way, I would still do it. And now I'm a lot more impatient as a player. I gotta go back to basics, man. I mean, given, you do have to rush some of your paths in the segmentation plant. But... Uh, just because you gotta identify a safe, a safe place and then execute your path quickly sometimes. Is there anything above it? No. Nope. Okay. I tried to bail because I tried to throw it straight up. I didn't, I didn't anticipate the ceiling one there. Please! <laughs> oh man, bummer. So close. So close. Brandon. Alright. Ain't Brandon's in chat? You gotta help me, Brandon. I can't do it on my own. Oh, what am I doing? There we go. You know, I should just leave. I don't know why I wasn't doing this before. I should leave four berries so I could buy my first revive quickly. berry over there, which I can get relatively easily, so I'm going to do it. Uh, when I start streaming, like, because you've been here the whole stream tonight, right? If you mean, like, in general, about five years ago, when Fine Sauce started, a little over five years ago, actually. 
to the right and see what the right looks like. That's nice. I really like that edging technique. Okay, so the laser on the left appears on the left tile in that gap. Okay. That's, ooh, check that out. That's a bug. Oh, and I was about to say the bug saved me, and then I missed that jump and it didn't matter. Fuck. <laughs> um, okay, so let's do a new build. Uh, so we're gonna still get a pot and two corrodes. Only five jump jars, which make me a little bit uncomfortable. <sighs> no, I'm, I'm just bad at this game. I've accepted it. Oh! <laughs> I don't even care anymore. Yeah, I was hoping for a jump out of that. But now we can reach this. Oh, fuck. Ah, fuck. That was so dumb. Damn it. I just... Yeah, I can't do it tonight. At least not yet. I thought I just had to get warmed up and... It's just getting worse. I'll have to go back to Chapter 1 and do some Chapter 1 things. Current goals are learning to use adhesion berries, trying to craft the item you found cost 16 and forging a sender. Tense, was that item, was it crafting two orbs? Because I keep telling Tobash to do it and he like won't do it. I'm like, dude, you gotta try it, you gotta see what it does. There's gotta be a reason that Davio put the crafter above that boss, or at the end of chapter one. And he's like, nah, it's just an easter egg. I'm like, come on, no, there's gotta be a reason. There's gotta be. Gotta be a reason. Maybe I'll go do it myself tonight. Mm. No, I am sorry. Sorry, weird lady. Okay. Ooh, I died from a laser. That's pretty funny. Damn it, Terrawind. We'll try a few more times, and then I'm gonna go back and do some Chapter 1 stuff. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 1. And I should have 4. Yep. Okay. You were listening to some guy talk about the lore of Nuclear Throne since he talked with the creators and they didn't agree on some of it. Huh. I imagine for minimal games like that, it's very largely up to interpretation. Same thing with like Binding of Isaac, you know? Ramirez lives. Is this Ramirez? For real? Try Centurial Trials if I go back. Oh, no. I, I look at chat at literally the worst times. Like, I'll look over just as a crush block is coming into view. Come on, Thomas. Tense. No, I'm not. I'm, I'm honestly not kind of. I'm not really a huge fan of the trials. I'm just. Like, they're so beyond my skill level that I like don't even find it fun like I just get to like level like five at most like when I did it 
during the beta, I would get to the segmentation plant like maybe one every like 25 attempts, and then I would die almost immediately. So I was just like, nope, I, I can't do that. Pulsing heat levels, I know. 43, that's nice, Tense. Good job, dude. That's an excellent... An excellent milestone. Yeah, this game's very hard, Ginger, and I love it. Still grab that corrode under pressure. I'm happy about that. I don't know, I would almost say that doing chapter 1 and 2 back to back would be harder than the trials, but maybe not. Some of those later levels that Tobash was doing earlier looked so absurdly hard. I can't... I can't wait to play them. Uh, okay, so now we have no revive potion, but we do have enough money to buy one. Okay, focus. Part 2, I noticed today that my glasses have been slipping down my face. I don't know why. Maybe that bent a little bit. I gotta fix that. I want another shot at the Volt Caves. I know I can do it. The Beebles don't team up on me. <gasps> okay, did not want to use that jump, but that's alright. What? No! What? What? <laughs> oh no! What made it blow up? What? Aw, oh, man. Alright, see ya, Queen of Pasta. Thanks for coming by. Making me feel self-conscious about my pastas. But, you know, it's okay. Is this game like a metaphor for, like, life, man? Yeah, I think it is. I lightly touched it? Really? I don't remember that at all. I didn't think I was anywhere near it. I'm so cute sometimes, thanks. <laughs> okay. Nice. Nice! Oh my god, Quasi, that'd be insane. Where do you guys live? We could we could host a meetup. It'll be fun. 25 man tower climb event. And we'll stream it and it'll be total insanity.
Oh, in Canada? Uh, maybe we won't meet up after. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Uh, we've been due for a Canada trip at some point. Carrie's been a few a few times. I haven't been since I was like nine. Oh, really? I thought it was more than once. Okay. What part, um... Where's Montreal? Wait, what part does Devin live in? Doesn't he live in the middle of nowhere? Manitoba? I don't know how close... I have no conception of... Uh, no concept of Canada's geography whatsoever. Is Manitoba anywhere near Montreal? Cool. That made it easy. Yeah, I remember I streamed Bully, which is not getting a sequel, by the way. Should clarify for any of you two on the Vine Vans who listen to that podcast, I was, you know, I didn't do my research, <laughs> nor did Vinny. Uh, but in, when I streamed Bully, I was passing every class no problem, but I could not pass Geography. It was the most embarrassing stream of my life. I'm just like ge Geography retarded. It's so bad. Um, I used to live in Pennsylvania, actually. I lived near Kennett Square, or by Philadelphia, too. <laughs> Philadelphia, too. Wow. I was reading Wario Dwarf's message that says, No Bully, too. And it slipped into my verbal thought and said, Philadelphia, too. <laughs> the sequel. The sunnier place. P people in Canada don't even know much about Manitoba. <laughs> That's pretty funny. I live in Texas now, so I had to get. I want to get as far away from Canada as possible. Womp womp. Ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> I don't know what that voice is. Don't ask. I'm not getting that berry after all. I was gonna get the berry, and I was like, no, I'm not gonna get. Spider-Man maneuver. Okay. What made me move? Uh, well, I grew... I became 26. And at 26, you lose your parents' health insurance. And my job offered health insurance, but, like, an extremely minor discount on it. And my paycheck was already absurdly low, and I wouldn't have been able to afford it. It was, it was just a good opportunity for a change. And my girlfriend lived in Boston at the time. Uh, so that whole, those two things combined, I was like, you know what? I'm going to move in with my girlfriend. And she was very generous and let me do so. Uh, and life's been pretty awesome ever since, to be honest. I live near um, Philadelphia. I went to college near Pittsburgh. So I moved to Boston, where Carrie was at the time, and then her job brought us up to Texas. Did I say up to Texas? Did I say that? Or is that just my memory, like, getting... becoming mush already? See, now I can do it because I'm, I'm already holding jump. I remember to do it this time. But, it's, I don't know. It's not all-encompassing enough. Did I say up to Texas? Like, right there. I tried to stick to the wall and I ended up jumping instead. Ooh, baby! Oh, no! Twice in a row. <laughs> I was so flustered by, like, the whole jumping, sticking thing there that I just couldn't, like mentally get in track again. You're gonna move probably to New Jersey? Really? You sure you, you sure you wanna do that, Marala? I'd much rather live where I am in Texas right now than anywhere in New Jersey. 
Yeah, Fred, he can do it. Couldn't do it. Although, I guess if I lived anywhere else in Texas, I would probably rather do New Jersey. Pretty much has to be Austin, or Austin or Bust, you know? No, I'm just I'm ripping on New Jersey on purpose. I've got a lot of family in New in New Jersey. That works too. I want that berry. Oh no. Oh, I wanted to go around the corner, and I didn't. Ah! Fourth wind. Alright, Henry. You gotta do it, Henry! It's up to you, Henry. California is a hell state? Really? I hear that, like, that NorCal is pretty cool. Up by the bay and stuff. <laughs> I don't know why I made a farty noise, but that's okay. Apparently, the nicest place in the world to live is. Nashville, Tennessee, I think. Was that it, Carrie? Well, you're the one that told me this fact. What do you mean you don't know? What, what state was it? You told me. Carrie. Okay, she's ignoring me. She told me one specific place that was considered the nicest place in America, and I can't remember what it was. Redwood City. I want to say it was Nashville, just because my buddy from high school lives in Nashville, and I made some kind of connection bet between those two facts. Or maybe, but another part of me is thinking it's someplace in Virginia, but that's probably too far north now that I think about it. It was someplace a bit more south. Nashville, during our stay there, was pretty awesome. Nice. Okay, that was way more risky than it had to be, just because the laser on the left. Looking at the berry in the left, the far left, trying to decide if I really wanted it. Also, have I died yet? No, okay. You're the only 10 I see. And then you do a snappy, pointy, clicky. There we go. <laughs> I couldn't do it at the time. My, both my hands were being used. Ugh. Mm. Fuck. 
Okay. Uh. Damn it, and then there's one that one up there. I'm gonna edge it and then fall to the left. Okay. It's important to have a plan. Okay. Oh fuck. Ooh, baby. Okay. Oh, this is so awful. Okay. Um Justice plan. Exactly what I wanted to do. That was awesome. Way too many lasers there. Go, 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 go down. Thank you. Nice. Nice. We still have our revive and 11 goddamn berries. However, buying from that guy is going to be a little bit difficult, so I'm going to wait for the next one. I love that flash. Ooh, baby, this is so dangerous. That's what Henry sounds like. I don't, I don't even remember if I'm still Henry, and probably not. unnecessarily dangerous maneuver I've ever done in my life. I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait right here. Dude, we might actually have the creator, one of the creators of Rick and Morty on our podcast next week. I want to try something. We're gonna talk about video games. Let's see what he gives me. Justin Roiland, yeah. Junk. Oh. Well, the good news is we are at the Vault Caves. Yeah! Gazorp Azorp field. Give me some damn enchiladas. White trash. <laughs> Ooh. Alright. Oh, I didn't even get it out. Oh, I let go early. Get away from me, Buzzy. I don't like you. I don't like your kind fuck. I'm gonna wait.
Oh, I didn't grab it. Are you kidding me? I tried to grab the ceiling, but the, because the last, uh, the elastic thing didn't disappear sooner. Ah, uh, fuck. I could just jump. One jump is worth three of those berries. Oh, I've only got four left though. Fuck. Fuck. How many? Um. Okay, I got plenty of those. Waiting for the beetle. Go away. <gasps> fuzzy, fuzzy, fuzzy. Why you do this, fuzzy? I don't like you very much right now, Fuzzy. Okay, see, that's what I wanted to do when I was trying to get those berries. buddy. Yeah, boy. Get to that fucking dough. Ooh, baby. Come on. Let's stick to this wall. This wall's been good to me. Just waiting for the goddamn beeble. It's gonna ruin me and this wall's relationship. I was ready for you, asshole. Yeah, Henry. I knew it was Henry. Hank. Good old Hank. I always knew he'd do great things. Fucking high score. Oh my god. Oh, those berries. I want those berries. I want those berries. I can go up and around just to make the descent a little easier. I'm gonna get those berries. Oh, look at that guy, though. I don't, I don't know if I want to approach him. <laughs> Can we blow him up? Did I miss? Okay. I'm guessing I don't want to touch that gas. This was worth it! Oh god, quick! And now there's a chest. Oh, what was that? What the fuck? Why? No! That's why, because I didn't have uh, a corrosion in my... I was looking for one. Oh god, he's still over there. Get the fuck away. Yeah, leather gloves. I do like those. Yeah, I know, I have my corrode potions, but I, was, I thought I had one in my inventory. But I didn't. I'm out. I'm all out.
Damn it! Fuck! Come on. I just had to hit him. And the goddamn springy things made it so much more difficult than it needed to be. Those beetles. Any differences I've noticed yet that's the last play on stream? Well, I played it, like, yesterday on stream, so... Um, and there's all of Chapter 2, which is brand new. So, yeah. They, they, they pretty much... They've over-doubled the content uh, with the Steam release. Pepperonis, yeah. Alright. We'll try one more time. One more time in chapter two, and then I'm going back down. Or I might actually, I might end the stream, I don't know. Was on the other side of the block. Uh, I was on the other side. Morala Shadow just subscribed. Thank you so much, Morala. Very, very helpful. Yeah, that is, lobotomies are terrifying to think about per pet. I can't believe that that was something that we, like, actually did at one point. Perfectly timed. It was ready for me. Alright, let's go back to chapter one for a little bit. No, Gregory. What are you doing, Gregory? You insisted. I thought I pressed teleport, but I didn't. Alright, Gregory, if you insist. Gregory is like, no, no. You think you're, you want to go back to chapter one, but you gotta trust me here. I've got this. It's not my decision. This was Gregory's decision. Okay. You guys gotta bear with me here. Hey, nice. Did you fuck up, Carrie? What happened? Carrie's playing Undertale. What'd you do? Where the fuck is Carrie? Carrie! Wake up, Carrie! Mmm! She sounded pissed about something. That's right. Duh. Okay. I sound like Mrs. Mrs. Big Head. <laughs> Beth Big Head. I freaking love. Oh god. I freaking love Rocco's Modern Life when I was a kid. I haven't watched it in many years. I'm sure I would still love it. Okay, I got like three jumps. So let's use them. Oh, no, that's too dangerous. I would like that berry, though. That's not too dangerous. Seed. Alright. I was so ready to grab that wall, and he just wouldn't move right any further. Oh 
don't know what happened there. Uh, that bums, bums me out. Okay. Oh no! The thing is, that was a double, a double-edged mistake on my end. I thought I wasn't gonna make it, and that was my first mistake because I did end up making it. My second mistake, it, it, well, it screwed me in two ways, I guess. Uh, because of that first mistake, I ended up dying there. I used a jump when I didn't need to use a jump. Alright, Quasimodo can do this because this is Quasi's avatar. I know I said I'm going back to Chapter 1, but you know, now we're playing as Quasi, and I can make him die in the most horrible way. It's my time for vengeance. See, I got like some sweet moves every once in a while like that. But the rest of the time I'm just beefing it. I fucked up. I, I just couldn't think of what to do there. I probably had like at least four options, and I didn't take any of them. Come on, really, buddy? Oh, duh. I, <laughs> that was just plain old blindness. Well, there you go. Let's check out the log. Let's see how much worse my death percentage here has gotten. Look at this flat line. No positive uh, positive correlation here. Okay, I'm scared. Okay, let's do bets. How about that? What do you guys think? What, what percent do you think I'm going to be at for number of deaths due to Crush Trap? Let's see who's closest. Let's see who's closest. I've died easily the most due to Crush Trap. I just want to see who's close to the percent. 60%? Oh, Jesus. 55? 30? I'm above 30, easily, because last I checked it was 42%. And I easily did not help with that percent this time. It doesn't matter how many runs is a percent thing. It's got to be at least 42% because that's where I was at last, unless I improved on it, and I don't think I did. <laughs> exactly 52%, 44. Also keep in mind, the more, the more deaths I do, the less it's going to sway that percent. Alright, here it goes. Dun dun dun! Boop! 42% <laughs> it hasn't budged. There you go. So, yesterday it was at 33%. I did some runs before bed and that bumped it up to 42%. Now it stayed at 42. What that tells me is I'm dying less to crush traps, or at least it's on the decline. On the decline. There you go, buddy. There you go. That, or it didn't save the number. Which is probably even more likely. Or, no, not necessarily. That sounds really insulting, and I apologize. But I don't know. It's just a weird coincidence that it's 42% still. And let me see the what I t what it was at when I tweeted you. Um. Yeah, I went from 37 deaths to 46 deaths, and it's still at 42%. There you go. So yeah, I'm getting there. Getting a little bit better. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, let's do a little bit of chapter one. There's a couple of side quests that I could do that I've never done. Like get this thing called the Bitch Bane, which then leads to other things. Uh, and then at the end I'm gonna I'm gonna craft those two orbs together because because Tobash won't do it. 
like a buster. Hey, I don't have to worry about buying my own stuff anymore. It's kind of nice too. Doop. Great. Oh, look how safe this is. Look how nice and safe this is. I could live here. Right here at the bottom of the tower. Direbor, thank you. Thank you so much for the host. Very, very appreciated. Uh, Direbor has been streaming passive runs of Undertale, or a passive run of Undertale. So if you want to catch it, you should definitely check out Dyer's channel. Oh, I keep doing that. Shout out Dyer Boar. There you go. I'm not doing Path of Exiles because I do want to get this thing. Let's see, are there, were there any spikes anywhere? Fuck, I didn't mean to do that. Spikes right there. Okay. Do I have to get the bitch bane all in one level? Like, can I do the kills against dogs count across multiple levels? No, Dyer was hosting me. Dyer hosted me. And Dyer is doing Undertale. Uh, where did my spike go? Did anyone see where it went? Do spikes disappear? Has to be in one level? Oh, okay. So I pretty much have to get that, that smelly thing. Oh, it's across levels. Okay, sweet. Good. Also, where did my spike go, man? Also, how many blocks was that? Let's do some testing. If that was there and it fell to here, that's one, two, one, two, three, four blocks without dying. You probably can't fall more than four, so one, two, one, two, three. I could probably do this without dying. Nice. Figured it out. Four blocks. All right, doggy. So block, so spikes do get consumed in these, uh, when you, oh, come on, I was grabbing a freaking wall. I didn't realize that spikes, yeah, I should have just stored all these, got consumed when you kill an enemy with them. Basically, to get this first quest item, I need to kill as many dogs as I can. I could also scum it, just restart the game until I get a, like a, the stinky level, because that's where a lot of dogs appear. But I ain't doing that. Not right now, at least. Maybe another time I'll scum it. Ooh, doggy. It's a shame I saw you here up top. Now you have to die. Oh, he's like, no, nah, I just want to be your buddy. Uh. Oh, it is all on one level. Pfft, fuck. <laughs> oh well, I got some spikes for later. Jeez, how many do I... So it does have to be in one level. Okay. Uh, all right. Good to know. No revive potion. I'm such a scrub. So it pretty much has to be one of those wet fur levels, or you just won't get enough dogs. Was that warning sound in builds before, or was that just added in today? Or, I mean, um, was that in last night, lights build, or was that just added in? Because I didn't notice it last time. I did notice the flash, but not the sound. Come on, give me that stinky fur level. I keep calling it wet fur, because it's Spelunky. But I think it just says it smells bad in here. 
Oh, it wasn't last night's. I just didn't notice it last night. Yep, I love killing dogs. You heard it. I've always been a cat person. Dogs just, you know, should be euthanized. <laughs> Sorry, that was terrible. No, I had, um... That's not totally true. I, I was a dog person for a long time. I, like, uh... My first pet that I had for any extended period of time was a dog named Robbie. Actually, I actually have a picture of Robbie. Hang on, let me throw this so I can show you guys. Let me find Robbie's picture. Where is it? My old pictures. Uh, I found one of my old dog George, but George was kind of a shithead, so I'm not showing him. There he is. That's me when I was like five and Robbie. When Robbie was like one, maybe. Uh, he was a great dog. I miss him a lot. Yeah, he passed away when I was like 19 and I'm 27 now, so it's been a while. But uh, he was great. Just so you know, I do love dogs, okay? It was a joke. I don't really want to kill them all just in this game. Yeah, it's a Westie, that's right. Yeah, 14 years, especially for... A Westie is pretty amazing. Or wait, maybe I got that backwards. I can't remember if dogs live longer when they're bigger or smaller. Oh, okay. That one didn't live long at all. I had blonde... Yeah, when I was really little, I had uh, super curly, super blonde hair. And then as I got older, it got more wavy and dark instead of curly and blonde. Like, in that picture, it wasn't curly anymore, but it was still pretty light. Oh, also, we didn't get the wet fur level. Womp womp. Um, is there a quick way to... Shift escape. We want to get a special level. I think I might speedrun it otherwise. Grab some spikes and then speedrun it until I get the level I need. Davius. Ah, oh, fuck. That wasn't even worth it if I could play. <laughs> you know, I could just kill myself until I get the event. Although it would fuck with my logs a lot. Can this be destroyed? It can. Okay, cool. Velociraptor, thanks for coming in. Shitting his heart out? Are, are, you're not kidding? Are you sure? I, I don't even think that's physically possible, is it? I could see, like, shitting your guts out, but your heart? Like, how does that even happen? Like, not to belittle your dog's memory at all, so I apologize, but I, I, I need to know. I'm just gonna get in the habit of always holding jump when I'm jumping into a wall, so I can always stick to it like that even if I have a jump proc. Look at this dumbass rat. What a dummy. Okay, let's do this.
Oh, look at this dumb dog. Chose such a bad place to sleep. He's like, no, don't do it. Don't do it. Okay, I'm gonna leave. It's like... Uh, <laughs> uh. No, I, I can do item jumps like it's no one's business. That's not an issue. What floor is this? Why does this game have pixels like Cave Story? Checkmate. Each floor is 300, so I'm on, what the, this is the third, so I'm, I'll be out of entrance, or ground level floors up. Yeah, fuck. Okay. Come on, give me that stinky level. Give me that stink. Give me that stink. Matthew, all right. All right, Matthew. Oh, look at this dumb rat. Oh, no, he's a smart rat. <laughs> Never mind. How tall is the player character? You could kind of tell. Well, we could figure this out. Let's see how tall he is. So this is 72 feet. And that is up to eight feet tall. He's jumping roughly four player heights. Sorry, that's six feet tall, even less. It goes from 72 feet to 78 feet, so that's six feet. And he's jumping about three or four player heights tall. Therefore, the player is roughly a foot and a half tall. It turns out you're a hobbit. Womp womp. Why does he enjoy a basketball team instead of climbing deadly towers? That's a great question. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, climbing gauntlets. Excellent. It's like the my favorite item. Alright, speedrunning time. That's my speedrun sound. If I started speedrunning seriously on Twitch, it would just annoy so many people. See, I can do these. No problem. You see? Did you see it? So pro! Um, how much do we even have? No. Oh, so pro. And I caught that berry. Hmm. I'm just too pro. And... Whoop. Whoa! Oh, okay. I fucked that up. Not as pro as I'd like. There's a dog there. Okay, maybe I'm not nearly as pro with that as I thought I was. I wanted to throw it straight down and then... Yeah. There we go. Ha 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 ha! Oh, what a dumbass. The monster should be a seer boss in the game. They have to shoot mad hoops with items to beat them. Oh my god. Oh, that's great. That's great. Um, can't throw those. Also, what floor? Fuck. Okay. Give me that smelly level. God damn it, David. I'm blaming David. 
I just want to get this bitch Bane. Please give it. Genius, I actually know exactly what he's talking about, and it's amazing that you brought up what you brought up. I'm not gonna spoil, but Jesus. Jesus dies. Just so you guys know. Stupid rat. Yeah, this is helping my- just playing through this first area over and over is really helping my general maneuverability. Did not help my berry throwing timing, though. Alright, see you, Solace. Have a good one, man. Oh, baby. That didn't go where I wanted it to go. Lava. Okay. Uh, there's probably a torch there. I just wanted to take some spikes in case I do get that level. Oh, hey there, Raddy. Raddy! No, I mean, the, uh, I made that up. Jesus doesn't die. He, um, no. I was just... I was just playing, dude. I didn't spoil anything. I hate it when people do that. Like, some asshole comes in and chat. Spoils, like, the biggest plot point of the game you're playing. Then it's like, oh, haha, ha, I was kidding. Like, trying to save face. Fuck those people. Ooh, sweet. Here's a chance to practice with the, the sword. So you can actually... Yeah, it's kind of a long wind-up, but... Cool. Uh, okay, we're killing all the dogs on this level and hoping it's enough. Probably won't be enough. If, if anything, just to get practice with the sword. Oh, and then I probably just accidentally bought a thing there. No humorinos in the streamerinos. Sorry, I forgot. This is a no humor stream. Oh yeah, there's a lot of like swords like this and stuff. Yeah. Oh, I didn't want to do that. That was an accident. I just wanted to jump and then tap it so that it would swing at the right time. You collect the death card if you get resurrected from- you have to actually view the card, I think. But that's a good question. I don't know why I did that. Ah, uh, fuck it. <laughs> Those spikes. Give me the thing. Ah. Uh, I take what I want, game. You haven't understood this yet. Yeah, the most cruel part about those death cards is that, like, you gotta work your way all the way to the very end. Uh, if you're a completionist, you need to do it uh, and collect the death card and you gotta beat the game. So you don't need to get to the end just once, but you have to pretty much do everything twice just to make sure that dying by it doesn't have a unique thing. Which is not a bad thing, I think it's awesome. It's actually kind of funny. Is numpad required for keys of code? No, they they have um they have a no numpad uh, key binding built in, but it's not that intuitive. Like, if you can get a numpad, they're usually, like, dirt cheap. You can get a USB numpad for, like, five bucks at Walmart. Uh, I would recommend it. Yeah, 
it, it makes a big difference in case of Kud. CQC. I actually read it the same way to cardboard. That one's too deep in the wall. It's actually a case of cud. I've just been saying cud for so long that I kind of just roll with it now. Next floor has to be it. Here we go. Yes. Hang on. And we have the balloon. How many inventory slots do we have? Two more. Oh, fuck, are you shitting me? Oh no. I did not mean to do that, clearly. He was playing. Playing jokes. I didn't think that was very funny, dog. Right now, I go back down, get those other spikes. Wait, do I still have the sword? No, I ditched it, didn't I? Or was that a different playthrough? I don't remember. Fuck. Quood? Why would it be Quood? <laughs> Sorry. Caves of Quood. When I was a kid, I would call the coupons coupons. I'm gonna use this coupon. Ooh, is that Vapor Wand? No, it's a spear, even better. Or not better, but you know. More uh, accessible, I guess. Oh, please. Please grab it. Okay. I just want that spear back. Please. Please give me the spear. I'm about to... F okay. Really? Are you shitting me right now? Dog, you're gonna get off my spear. Right now. Right? Now. Wake up! Get the fuck off my spear! This guy's dead. Fuck you! Alright, dog. Ooh, I caught it again when it bounced back. Okay, hang on, hang Okay, I'm losing control. There we go! Quest, Arsenal of the Ascended. Oh, well, that's a lot easier to control. A blacksmith forged his blade to free his buddy from the throb. Or, I missed that. In case Arsenal needs to be ready again. Oh, shit! Oh, no, I didn't mean to do that! I didn't want to break it. I didn't want to break it. Nope. Don't make me fall. Please. Oh, uh, shit. Oh, I can just store it, of course. Duh. I don't know why I was thinking it was going to be an issue. Okay, these guys are getting bitch bane. Can I even... Can you get stung to death? Can I... I don't think... Okay. Yeah, you can't slice him. Can't slice him, dice him. Nope. Nope. 
Oh, the actually the wasp. I was gonna say the wasp helped me there because it stunned me away from the dog, but then it killed me. That cheeky wasp. That cheeky wasp. Dude, try cutting a bee in real life. It's a really good point. <laughs> To be fair, if this dude is a foot and a half tall, and a bee is about a third the height of the dude, this bee is about six inches in diameter. So fuck those wasps is all I gotta say. Yeah, I mean, but what are the odds that I would get a balloon level combined with the fur level and then accidentally slash the balloon? I didn't even realize you could break those balloons. All right, let's do Centurial Trials to wrap up the night. Expect a lot of failure, though. You know, can you combine... Combine these two? Do Centurial Trials for Floor 2? Aw. Oh, that would have been pretty sweet. Nope. Alrighty. Alrighty. Set on. Oh wow, I thought I was underwater. Well, I'm just glad I didn't die. I could get the bitch bane again right here. Oh, fuck. Nope. Panic. That's what happens when I panic. I always forget that he starts with uh, fast items. Yeah, he starts with the climbing, whatchamacallits. What are these even called? Arcane gauntlets, that's it. No berries, though. <laughs> that's like the biggest noobish mistake I've ever I've ever done. My favorite floor dev? You'll you'll need to elaborate on that. I haven't done trials at all in this build, in case that wasn't clear. <laughs> I'm not that bad. My favorite floor dev. I know, I saw everything that Tobash was getting to after the Volt Cave, and I was like, well, fuck, I need to get there. It looks like so much fun. I keep thinking I'm underwater because of that effect. I'm not. What the dev's favorite floor? Oh, there's there should be a comma. I see. What's your favorite floor, dev? I see. I thought he was asking me what my favorite floor dev was. I was like, what the hell's a floor dev? Like, the developer that makes the best floors? in video games. I always thought the floor in Metal Gear Solid felt kind of nice. And it was dynamic, which was pretty sweet for its time. I don't need those. Yeah, Zarderland, oh my god. Oh my god. And let's, um, get rid of something. Just so I can store this. Oh! No! Oh. Everything was wrong. Oh, another one. Okay. Yeah, that fast floor is always the killer for me. Fuck 
that bad. I'm not even gonna bother. Not playing. Oh, shit. Uh, whatever, I'll use a seed. Doesn't matter to me. Yeah, I got two of these out of it anyway. So, whatever. And another thing, now I actually have practice at the segmentation plan. So even if I do get to floor 10, I'll actually stand a chance now. Which is really nice. Also, how many teleportation potions do you start with in Centurial? Four? Boots. Okay. Five teleports. Nice. <gasps> oh my god, I didn't jump. These are my favorite levels, the combinations between um, ice and fire. Pretty much in like any video game, like the Freeze Flame Galaxy from Super Mario Galaxy. Freaking ace. Top notch. Hmm. Could get the bitch bane here too. I slipped! Oh, I'm gonna die! Bat. Dog. Go back to sleep. Thank you. <laughs> okay. I'm out of here. I'm gonna climb out here. Yep, I'm gonna go all the way up this way. Please. Please let me do it. All oh, right, I forgot they can't do that. All righty. Cool, did it. Oh, fuck. If I remember, the best strategy for this is to climb quick before the guys can start vomiting. Because they only start vomiting after they've seen you or something. Or after they've been on screen long enough. Please, no. Top one. There we go. Bat. Bat! Mmm! Oh, baby! Did it. Did you see how quickly I got away from that bat? I was like, see you later, buddy. Not gonna bother. thought I needed it. Oh, no. oh that bastard! That bat stirred. <laughs> okay. Hey, what's up, Kozinki? How you doing, man? so hard. I tried to throw it down and I ended up throwing it right. Wait. Oh, my inventory is full. Okay. Oh my god. Uh, 
Do you know how to look at environment objects and get the flavor text? Yep. Hilarious. I'm a funny guy. Did you see what I did? Ah, oh, I bet you guys got quite a chuckle out of that. Uh, do you know how to look at environment objects and get the flavor text? Kinda. Or I understand, like, that certain things only appear in certain floors, so you can kind of get the combination based on the objects. Is that what you're saying? Yeah, we're still tower, tower climbing Graham. Although, I'm going to be wrapping up really soon. Did I say this was short? I don't think I said that. I don't think so. But maybe I did. I don't know why I would say that. We won't get... Uh, struck by lightning, we'll be fine. Fuck. We'll be fine, we won't get struck. It'll be worth it. And I kind of need the death text, so even if we do. See, it was worth it. You know, we should get the death text while we're here. Did it happen? Adrian was revived somehow. There we go. Nice. We did not get that death card before, so now we got it. That was worth it. All right. Oh, oh no, it isn't underwater. I thought it was for a split second. I keep thinking that. It's just the sweltering heat this time. Quick, go quick, go quick. Yeah, I'm gonna need to let them keep once. Go, 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 go. Fuck. Okay. All right. Well, it's a combination of design elements. Oh, fuck. No. Nope, I'm dead. It was fun. Alright. I think I'm about burned out for tonight. I can't. I can't even. So, uh, hope you enjoyed the stream. Maybe we'll make some progress in Chapter 2 next time. Maybe we'll get the Bitch Bane Chapter 1. Maybe we'll get that hammer and forge two orbs together and see what happens and all sorts of things we can do with tower climb <sighs> okay i'll catch you guys next stream thanks for watching i hope you enjoyed uh let me link you the steam page for this game because like i said this game is really really fantastic uh and i want it to get a lot of success so i'm gonna link it consider picking it up if you got a few bucks, you will not regret it. At least if you like these kind of games, this is definitely top notch. Make sure you read the manual if you pick it up, because it's very illuminating. Um, let's see if there's any art. Any art. No new art. Okay. Well, thanks for following, and thanks to new subscribers, and I will catch you next stream. Uh, more Star Control 2 sometime soon. Uh, what else was I going to check out? Oh, Armello. I want to check out soon because that game looks pretty neat. There's a new game called Sublevel Zero that I might get at some point because it's a Descent uh, inspired game and I love Descent. So many things, guys. So many things. All right. I'll catch you all next time. Have a good one.